overcoming challenges, creating solutions. These professionals are cleaning superheroes. Hi, my name is Terry Johnson. I work for Source America. I'm a quality manager for the Pacific West region out of the San Ramon office in California. My office received a call from one of our customers. Uh, we work in the federal environment. We're the largest Jansan supplier to the federal government. They called us and indicated that there's a performance problem with one of our uh, nonprofits that works in a uh, multi-story building. So uh, a colleague of mine and I went to verify the, the issue. Um, and we did discover that there were multiple problems with not only performance, but there were issues with the facility that uh, contributed to the, the problem of performance. One of the things that we did find were the, the um, janitor closets in uh, the, the drains were clogged on the second floor, so everything above that could not be used or the drain would back up. So the, the janitors were having to come from the upper floors down to, um, down to the basement to change their water. One of the things we did to change that was uh, go to a flat mop system with a dispenser on the handle, which eliminated having to use water at all. One of the other things we noticed was that the, the janitors were taking an hour or up to an hour to load their carts and get on to their task. Well, the reason for that was that they were emptying the carts after their shift and had to reload it at the beginning of their shift. So we changed that and had, had them actually load the cart or replenish it at the end of their shift so the carts were ready in the morning and they could get on their way within about 10 minutes. One of the other things we noticed was that they did not have a periodic or routine schedule. So we generated uh, a fully written uh, master schedule for, for them to work by. The, the janitors typically would just move through the building and do whatever they wanted to do. And in, in essence, they weren't cleaning at all. So uh, having a master schedule and, and these job cards actually forced them to uh, spend a specific amount of time to, to do the job, say like an hour in a space doing just dusting. So in that way, you could tell, well, what were they doing after an hour if they didn't do the dusting? The customer was forcing them to put down wax on, on the restroom tile. And after a while, that degrades and, you know, uh, dirt collects underneath that. And so uh, what we did was have them uh, recondition all the floors and remove all of the wax from the floors and just leave them like that. And, and now with the flat mops, they've been able to maintain um, a good appearance. So we had, we had a meeting with our, our customer to determine if he was satisfied with the changes that we've made. And he had indicated that he did notice a significant change in, in the service and that, that the janitors were making significant changes and, and moving through the building in a much more purposeful way and he could actually see a lot of changes that, that we made in the restrooms and that he had been receiving a lot of compliments from uh, the various tenants in the building. Learn more about becoming a cleaning superhero at issa.com heroes.